All right, I'm just gonna go teach you how comical MetaZoo is. That the fact that Alpha Investments is still pumping this is kind of crazy. So MetaZoo's new strategy is Claire's. I'm gonna read you something about Claire's. Since 1974, Claire's has been a fun fashion destination for jewelry, cosmetics, accessories, and air piercings for tweens, teens, and young girls between 3 and 18 years of age. So Claire's demographic is females between 3 and 18. Okay? We're looking at a picture. I think I see one female on the left, but I think uh, most of these individuals are not female. And these most of these individuals, I assume, are eight over the age of 18, which is the age of consent, right? Could you imagine the disaster that is going to hit Claire's, right? When these individuals, right, th this is my only thing from Meadow Zoo Tournament, um, again, I googled it. This is the only example of a Meadow Zoo tournament I've ever seen on Google. There isn't, I was expecting maybe small local shops and so on, but this should tell you, okay, there's kind of a, a younger person on the middle, but you can kind of tell they're probably between the age of 25 to 40, right? You can smell the picture, if you will, which is not a good sign. It's not a good sign that you can smell the picture uh, they they are, they got beards and and this is not the demographic that Claire's wants in their store. Okay, let me repeat this again. This is the not the demographic that Claire's, which is a jewelry, cosmetics, accessory, and this is according to their website, by the way. Claire's is targeting people who are girls in particular, particular who are between three and eighteen years old. Mm, okay, so how many of those in that demographic do we see? Could you imagine just a bunch of dudes in the picture I just showed you heading to Claire's at their local mall? The Claire's associate, who's probably a, a teenager, uh, probably a young female teenager, is going to call the police. That's what's going to happen if that large amount of people are trying to get the Hello Kitty release at Claire's, right? I have no idea that these two demographics cannot be in more different. Like, Karami, Hello Kitty, um, Cinebro. These are not cryptids, you idiots. These are fake things that somebody... This is like an anime. It's, like, I'm trying to explain this to the Meta Zoo people, but they don't get it. Um, I, I'm not understanding why they don't understand, but these are not cryptids. These are imaginary things that Sanrio created them. They're not real. Right. So I think what happened was they targeted a demographic with very questionable IQ because they believe Bigfoot is real. They these are like conspiracy theorists. They believe Mothman is real. Right. That's their logo. So they they, they cornered the market on gullible individuals who actually believe Bigfoot and Nessie and Loch Ness Monster is real. These people will buy anything and they will do anything. And now you're sending these crazed MetaZoo people who are overweight, smell like trash cans, haven't showered in over a decade, to Claire's? Are you kidding me? Like, like you understand? The, the demographic of Claire's is so different than the current demographic of MetaZoo that I don't... I can, am I the only content creator in MetaZoo seeing that this is not right? I mean, look at the look at the people on Claire's. Look, like, this is... You know, this. how many of them are the same people who go to Meta? Compare these pictures. I mean, I mean, my God, the Meta Zoo people will be arrested. And, and, and Man, it, it's just... Guys, I'll go, okay, I mean, I'm going to be straight honest with you. Um, I have a niece. I would never take her to their Meta Zoo. I would never take her. And if I saw a bunch of random randos, Meta Zoo players and Claire's, I would not take her to Claire's no more either. This could ruin Claire's. Could you imagine? Okay, cool. And, and Claire's already, I, I get from Claire's stance, they don't actually know much about MetaZoo. That's the only excuse they have. And they already sell Hello Kitty stuff, so it kind of makes sense. It's a Hello Kitty collab, right? Okay, let's do it. 
But ha- does anyone in Claire's know what the med- average MetaZoo player looks like? It looks like Argos, right? It's an older individual with a silver hair, right? Who's playing a children's card game. I mean, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. Um, or it looks like Rudy. I mean, they're kind of the same age, right? It's an older individual who is playing, uh, you know, crowns, Rudy crown eater and this and that. And and it just doesn't. And then I look at the MetaZoo tournament, right? And I look at these individuals. Then I compare it to the individuals on the pictures on Claire's. And I say, okay, if you put these two individuals in a room, half of them would be arrested and go to jail. I mean, honestly, let's say that, hey, you, you had these two individuals and, they're, you know, you, I mean, you can understand that this is not a good idea, MetaZoo, but none of their content creators have spoken up about this. I don't know why. I mean, I, I do not know why no one has spoken up about why this is such a bad idea. These two demographics are not going to mix. They just cannot, even legally. Like, this doesn't make any sense. Like, this puts them, I mean, I, I mean, it's mother effing Claire's. Like, are you kidding me? Like, you want the people who want to eat at Arby's every day, doesn't shower, farts all over the place. You want to send them to Claire's? Like, to Claire's? And, and half of these MetaZoo people are so dumb, they don't know my joke. Like, you know, in the office, there's a joke when they're trying to set um, Michael up. And Kevin send, says, hey, I know a, a woman. She's very, she's got blonde, she's got red hair, and she's great. And then he gives uh, Michael the number, and it turns out, and then the woman's name is Wendy. And it turns out it's a um, Wendy's, like the restaurant, right? And not the a Wendy, a person. And Michael's like, and then there's that very famous quote, sir... This is a Wendy's, right? And then I, I made that comment, and no one got it because they're so. I I don't know, man. I I, I have no idea. I had to lead these guys, right? I gotta lead the MetaZoo people away from danger. Danger, stranger, danger, guys. Stranger, you're the stranger, okay? You're the danger, okay? I gotta lead them away, right? And I gotta kind of like you know we gotta get off. We, we got guys. We cannot go to Claire's. We cannot go to Claire's as thirty-six-year-old guy, Asian male, should not be going to Claire's unless he has a he has a daughter or someone, you know, a non-binary individual that is interested in ear piercing. Okay, makes sense. Or a niece or someone. You you cannot go to Claire's, my dude, by yourself to buy Hello Kitty cards. Guys, stop it. 